Hey everyone, John from War Jeepney, and we are playing a 90 point rice game for Bushido. I'm, a, I'm up against Cult of Yuri, and I'm running my Ito clan. Uh, we already have deployed. I have here Mitsuki, Itsunagi, Satoshi, Akimoto, and Chiyo. And the opponent? My opponent is Jay, <coughs> and he will let us know what he right, has so got here. I'm running a Death and Decay Cult of Yuri list. Uh, it's 90 points. I have two upgrades. So there's a, a Fresh on Araka, and I have Green Spear. So my, that's practically my um, my lineup for, for my upgrades. But um, I also am bringing a Kairai Militia, an Armored Kairai. Gengo, Kato, the Puppet Master, and as, as I mentioned, Araka. And finally, it's the second game, but first day playing with the uh, eldest brother, which I just painted up a couple of hours ago. Alright, and we are playing the uh, three objective zone mission on this uh, modern Japan map with uh, cautious with caution marks on the road. Okay, and we will roll for initiative. Let's roll. Three. I roll a three. Three is a three. I have a six is two. Two, I think. So what I will do is I will make the Cult of Fury go first. So we are now in the middle of the first turn and most of our guys moved forward except for Mitsuki there who just focused to add some team. He, we have some guys here. He has uh, Kirai there inside that zone and I have Chiyo there outside. We have Satoshi here, Akimoto. We have the eldest brother there. We have Akirai here right outside. Ikirio, am I correct? No, no, that's uh, Kato. That's uh, Kato and he has brought down his marionette. And right now, this big undead Oni has moved forward to attack Itsunagi in melee and we will have a melee exchange. So he makes an attack but I allot all on defense and Itsunagi is able to uh, defend himself. Second turn and Cult of Yure wins initiative. He did not... no any rage? No any rage. No any rage. So I'm declaring a move action against him. He has two key, right? Yes, I have two key. Two key against a three key. Okay, I have resistance one. So let's roll. Eight. No way to beat it. I make a seven. Eight. I make an eight. I roll more dice. Yes, so what so happens to Itsunagi? You get four control Arrow, markers. Four control markers on Itsunagi. Oh no, that is, that is not good at all. For my turn, I will activate Akimoto and make a ranged attack. Impetuous, so I have to activate him first. No choice. I'll just uh, try to poison this Onisho with a range attack. I need a four. He is large, What's, so that should be no, a two to a hit. Medium, medium. medium, so three to hit. Three to hit, yeah. Three to hit on two dice. That's I make a, a seven, seven so, four so four poison four on that guy. So he's using my Itsunagi to charge two Mitsuki markers. and is using two control three markers. Three. So Itsunagi is hitting Mitsuki. I will uh, spend Three of my key to increase my dice pool and declaring sidestep defense. All attacks, so he gets brutal. He rolls a six, seven, eight. I roll a six, seven, eight. I have four. I win four by zero. dice. He wins by zero. Uh, you're brutal. One. So one. So he wins by one. One damage in. What's his plus, MWS? Uh, one. So three plus three right now. Five, that's an Six, eight, so, so basically take, take one. one. Mizuki takes one damage. Either five and two so dice. I will activate Satoshi and try to get rid of this guy here. I'll move right there. Uh, fear six. So I need, uh, I'm two key. So I need, that is a six. So I have overcome my fear and we will undergo a melee exchange. Going on one attack and two defense, I go all on defense and I declare push defense because I want to push him out. Okay, so, and I simply push him out of the zone. One inch. 
not with him. Uh, until the eldest brother moves around and engages Satoshi. So I will face. I go all on defense, push defense again. He goes all in attack. I have brutal one. Brutal one. I have parry one. That's an eight for him. And seven for, you. seven for me. I will pro as melee this one. It's an eight. I'm it's an eight. Player. I yeah, so he's got brutal. I have parry, so he hits for zero. Strong. Plus he's strong. So, so that's a six. Plus two. Seven, eight. It's so he hits zero. for zero. So I survive. I don't get damage, and my guy is tapped out. G over here. Okay, so dice allotment. I have two on attack, one on defense. Two on attack, one on two defense. Two on the attack, one on defense also. So I will roll. Uh oh. I'm a defense defense. of zero. I'm an attack, I have attack of, of five. So two in. So it's only two in. And I have three in. After. Two in, and I hope I kill it. <laughs> Eight minus two is. Six. Six. So, so two in. Two in. Minus one for tough. One in. So only one in on that Kirai. Tough Kirai. And he deals how much damage three. to me? Three in. So three two in. One. And I'll be at plus one. So that's a nine, ten. Is so plus four one. in. So four in. Four in. So Chiyo is. Chiyo over here is down to one. I'm activating him. Remove slow using Gengo. And then move four into base contact with this two. Ganging up on Satoshi. So, so I'm two. base three and down to two dice. I will spend two of my key. If you're not indomitable. Oh yeah, I have to spend on... Sorry, spend two to make him indomitable and I spend two to increase my parry, so I'm now parry two. Mm -hmm. I only have two defense dice. He's attacking with two attack. So I'll push attack, to, uh, push defense on him. And I'm a six, seven, eight, nine, seven, so I just push him. Why? Seven? Uh, parry two. Uh, I am parry two. Brutal, so, no, no. Yeah. so parry 2 Brutal helps one. me win that tie and I get to push him one inch away. I will activate Akimoto, uh, walk into the house and gang up on that armored Kirai. So the undead Oni tries to gang up again against Satoshi and let's see what happens. Let's allot some dice. So he's down to two. I cannot be ganged up. I am exhausted, so I'm down to two dice. All on defense. All on attack. Six. I make only a four. He makes a six. I will pro as my two. You're a five. So I'm a five. So he's got one in. I am armor two. Strong. Okay, that's uh, another die. Roll that other dice. So that's a four. Ah, six. Sorry. Six plus oh, two. Six. So eight. Just one. I'm armor two. Six. six. One. Yeah, so one in on Sato. Having a problem with uh, it's Nagi being controlled. What I'll do is I'll pass and let Jay make a move again because I am currently out activated. Indomitable. I'll charge. Uh, go. Yeah, I'll charge. Charging. So. Still the penalty of being exhausted. I am still indomitable too. So I am two attacks, you're two dice. Yep. I will have my dice here. Okay. All defense, push defense. I am a I am two dice at seven because I have a base of parry one. You are at seven. two dice at seven, so uh, he still wins the tie. But zero damage. Zero damage. But that is a charge, so that will negate my armor. So zero damage. And they're all ganged up there, and I'm able to push it. Uh, Mitsuki will just. You have to check on that rule. Can you pass if you are in melee? Okay, so uh, she will just wait. My turn. I will melee. And move there. And now 
I finally get that gang up of one. I'm at melee. You're down to one. I'm down to one. I'm at two. I have no key to spend, so I just only have this. I'll spend six key. He spent his six key. For two more dice. Okay, and all those dice. All on attack. All on. He's going all on attack. My defense is four because I have parry one. I am uh, five. Five. But I'm using ivory. That's why I did not use two of my dice. Okay. So you are now a pirate. Mm -hmm. So ivory attack instantly kills Satoshi and he becomes a Kerai. So sad. So Satoshi now turns into that mindless zombie. So I will activate Chiyo and attack the armored Kirai. I'm down to one. Outnumbered, exhausted, so down to one. I will go all in attack. He's on defense. I will roll my dice. I have a seven total. Seven is to zero, so seven damage. But he has armor. So that's zero. That's uh, zero, so still deals. Seven. Yes, At seven. six damage because he's tough. tough. So now I think that he's check. going to do a rice check. On a four, he's prone. What does he make? Three. He's yep, dead. so that guy there is out. Kato waits, and then this guy moves into close combat. Surprises that snake dude. Surprises Akimoto. Yeah. But he's slow, so. <laughs> You do lose one die okay. for exhausted and one die for surprise, but I am still. So I'm now attacking at zero dice, so I will have, I will have um, one dice, three dice, and you will have three dice. But he is slow. How many wounds on this guy? Five, five wounds. Tough. Five wounds and he is tough. Three is two. But he's reach, so. So he will strike. Still attack first. Still attack first. Okay. I'll just defend. I have defense of six. Uh, five. I survive. You turn? Okay, yeah. So he's Consider turned. him turn. Yeah. And then my last activation. I will attack again. And he will attack again. But now I'm slow, no more reach. Because he started in this point. Yep. But I'm still just defending. Because I have to put one on defense. Have the guys there. No, no Two. attack. Two attack. And I defend again. Yeah, so I'll just turn him around later. So end of turn two, he scores the VP because he got more guys at the zones. Since turn one, uh, Itsunagi is still controlled, still two control markers. He's still busy with uh, Mitsuki. And I only have Akimoto and Chiyu here left against this bunch of undead zombies and the Unishio outside. So we'll now start with turn 3, so we'll roll our initiative. I make a 1, I'm a 4, four so he has initiative. 4 poison counters. He has 4 poison counters. Where, where did he get the poison from? From this guy spitting. No, wala, wala. Uh, I made a mistake there because that's not, that's 4 poison 1 counters. So since he's tough, tough one. he'll just sh shrug it all out, so that's nothing. Okay. My first activation, I will use um, uh, this militia to attack that snake guy. The snake guy, okay. We forgot the fear check. Uh, snake guy also has fear. I don't know. I have. I have no, no, I have, I have to trigger the fear. Uh, what he is fear, fear five. Uh, yeah. Oh, no. I should have triggered. It's fine. Let's, let's just go play. Okay. So, I'm attacking with two dice. Attacking with two dice. Okay. I have two dice. I'm going 1-1. One, one. I'm a, a 5. I'm a 2. So, so I'm, I take... I'm slow. Yeah. I take the 5 first. Okay. So, take 5 first. 2d6. Eight is a zero. Eight is a zero. So I take five. One. So Akimoto strikes first, and now you take my five. Deals five damage, and then now I take. I have a defense of two. I, you take my three. So taking three plus two d six. Assault. So I take three. Yeah, that's just take three. So Akimoto takes three damage. I will activate Mitsuki and declare a disengage against Itsunami. 
I'm going three defense, all on attack. Sidestep defense if I can. Yeah. He's at eight. Uh oh. I am only at five. So eight plus your brutal. Five in. Five in. Plus two d six. That's a six in. Seven in. A seven in. So Mitsuki is killed. Mitsuki is killed, and she turns into an undead dude. But now I will give him. The militia attacks again against Akimoto, and I will go like one attack, one defense. He's going all on attack. Defense of six. Attack of six. Attack of six. I roll more dice, so I yes. Uh, you're you're activating, so dealing zero damage. And what do you roll? Six now. So nothing, and I deal 3 damage back to you, at no defense. So 3 damage... Uh, minus 1. Minus 1, minus 2. So minus Why 1 damage. Are, are you tough? So no damage. What a, what a bad roll over there. No damage. Actually, I'm melee minus 1, so it's really, really no damage. And uh, that removes a counter from Akimoto, and it's now exhausted. So I'm declaring a run action. Putting him there. Running him away. He is back on my side now, but uh, he stepped out. And I will pass again because I have four pass tokens. Pass. Hmm. I will move the militia here. Oh, sorry, I'm prone. He will stand up. He will stand. I will pass again. This is all I'm Down to three. I have two passes left. And then I will move with um, uh, eldest brother. I just move back here. I will declare, declare pass again, down to one pass. I will uh, move this here. He did not pass. He is moving the undead on over there. And I will call pass again. That's my last pass. And I'll have to activate Shio now. I will move with my militia here. For my activation, I move Shio out of the house and around to the corner over there. See if I can do something back here. Um, he will activate. Kato is activating. He's just move. Uh, he can't move. He will. Yes, uh, And he is brought out that little annoying doll again. Since that stupid evil doll is there, I'll move Chio back down here to the corner to five. I'm, I think I'm better off against this big monster than that little doll. So he's moving there and using his ranged attack. Throw. I forgot he had a ranged attack. Maybe I should have hid behind that corner. So that's a four. Four to hit. That's one for moving. Yes, so five to hit on two dice. And that is a zero damage hit. He's strong. He is strong. So six, so zero damage. He will move. Yeah, he's moving his guys around. Uh, no, he'll just focus. Okay, one guy will focus. For one key. <laughs> Focusing for one key. And Akimoto holding the door over there. It's end of turn three. And right now I am down to Akimoto, Chiyo. And now Itsunagi who is back at my side. I automatically win initiative on turn four. Automatically wins initiative at turn four. And roll for the Oni. He's doing Oni Rage. I get two more key. Gets two more key. And I will oh, do Oni on there. Melee attack. So melee exchange. Uh, I'm the defender so I spend three key. And uh, yeah, I should spend first three key and then I will go like this. All on attack. Eight. I make a defense of just six. So two in. He is two in. Strong. And, 
and I think I am dead. Yes, he's uh, she is down to one, so he only really needs to deal one damage, and she is killed. And she turns into a and she turns into a Kairai. Oh my gosh, what's the name of this theme again? Death and decay. Death and decay, turning all my dudes into the kingdom zombies. Akimoto is impetuous, so we'll have to attack first, and I'll make a melee strike against. Uh, this guy is that actually in base contact with this. Yeah, that guy should be in base contact. But let's see what happens. Let's go. Uh, two dice. I have two dice. Going all on attack. Gotta get rid of those zombies. Too many on the table. So Defense of seven. I make a six and I fail. No, no problem. So for his activation, he makes that uh, guy there stand. And what I will do is I need some objectives. I will make Itsunagi run up this side here. So Itsunagi runs up that side there. And I believe he is activating Araka. Araka. Since he only reached at the end of this face, yeah, you will gain. He will gain one control marker, but you cannot okay. only reach. So I will move him three here and four there. Wait, so I get the control? Yes, you, you control him for one activation next turn. Okay, he's exhausted. So he's there and he's exhausted, but he's under my control. And I'll activate Akimoto again and initiate a melee exchange. I wonder if that's a smart thing to do, but yeah, let's just do it. <laughs> all on attack. All on defense. All on defense. I make a... yeah, I miss. So that Kirai holds there and Akimoto is exhausted. So we have a... is that a Kirai? Yeah, but Kato. Kato. Kato is moving in, engaging Akimoto there. So I have base 2. Are you spending? Uh, is Kato fear? Yeah, ah, no, no, no. I will spend 2 key and give myself fear 6 so you have to make a fear that check. That's an, that is an instant uh, feat. So I can do it. So he's got to roll a 6 okay. on 3. 3 dice? On 3 dice. On 3 dice. Which, I do. Which he does. So his activation continues. So I have 2 at 2 and then you have base <laughs> one. 2. You have 1. You're, you're have 0. Yes, I am. I'm ganged up also, so I'm zero. So, so I'm at three. He's at three dice. I have get that one for defense. I'm buying one more, so I'm at four. He's buying one more at four, but this will be a super roll. I have a... And I make a six. I just need a six. Seven. Seven. Ivory, Ivory and he's, he's now uh, instantly killed, and he turns into a armored Kyra. Armored Kyra. He turned my snake man to ivories in one game. Into an undead guy. Two ivories in one game. Guy. Two ivories in one game. Ivory attacks. That's why I wanted to kill him from the start. I just couldn't get there. Okay, I will pass. Because I think I have a gazillion pass tokens. Uh, I'll just wait, wait, wait. He's waiting all on my passes. Uh, your last activation. Yeah. So you're all tapped out. Uh, no, I, I have a lot, but I'll wait one. Yeah. So and I think then, you have to uh, yeah, wait two, three, yeah. four, five, yeah. six, seven. So I have four. Yeah. Okay. This is turn four, so Tsunagi can't get there. It's a scoring turn. It's a scoring turn. Yeah, let's walk him up. I'll just walk him up. Walk five. We'll get him about somewhere there. So not enough really to get in. That's the run token. And that is all I have. And he'll pass. And he'll pass everything. Uh, wait for the king. I score one more victory point. Thank one you. more victory point. Two victory points. Uh, turn four is to zero. And I only have Itsunagi yet. Am I conceding? No. No, but the thing is, you can't score one more. You can't score two more victory. Yeah. There's only one left on turn six. Yes. But my objective is just to kill this guy here. <laughs> okay. I'm losing this game, but I just want to kill him next turn. All right. So okay. this is now turn five, and we're having our initiative. So turn five. 
So he rolls a 2 And I will win I roll a I roll a 4 And for my first activation I have no one else left to move I will kill this, this VIP model, no, just attacking, because I don't think I can get that guy on the charge. So just moving, and I am attacking. So he has he has reach. I spend on lightning reflexes. He also spends key to bump up his dice. Also spend key to bump up my dice. I have six dice, so three on three. He has two and three. So let's make our rolls. I have an attack of seven. Seven. I have an attack of three, four, five, because I have Kata. So this is your attack. Oh, sorry, the defense of five. Defense of five. I am six. Oh, seven. seven. Two in. Two in. Your attack is just a, a seven plus one vertical. Eight. Are you in markers? So he'll get one in. Yeah, I'll just reroll this with my pro S melee. So it, at least I am now an eight. Eight against five, so three in. So three in. Five plus six. So three in only. Uh, tough. Tough one. Tough yeah. one. So two in. So I deal, I deal two damage to that guy. And now I'm dealing. Double now. I have a eight. defense Level of one. wait. I'll I'll make you. I have a, a default dodge, so I'll make you roll the highest dice. Six. Highest one is the six. So I'm at five six. Six is to my seven, so I dodge. So I deal two damage, and that's it. Minus three. And I still have one activation left. He is activating the eldest brother and he's going to attack Itsunagi. I have four dice, no key left. So I just have my four dice. I'm going three defense, one attack. Yes. Okay. Is that all attack? Yeah. No, no, all defense. Eight. All defense. Okay. So I have. He wins his defense, and uh, and I nothing. So nothing happens. Just removes me of my activation. You're at what? What's your point? What point? Points. Rice man. Twenty-five rice. You said 25 rice. <laughs> well, at this point, I don't think I can do really much anything else. I can, score I can still activate this guy, but that's nothing. He'll still score for this too. And I failed my uh, personal objective of killing that guy. Yeah, so, uh, I think he's a very good model. I think he, uh, he uh, he's worth getting. So, if you still uh, are thinking about ordering that eldest brother, he pretty much... I think uh, yeah, he's proven himself in proven oh, himself in yeah combat. in combat even against my uh, samurai guy Itsunagi. So win goes to the evil and cheaty the kingdom cult of Yuri.